Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, one of the things that is added in the latest build that is going to probably make it to a Windows 11 user eventually within the next months is a new way of power management for Windows 11. And what I mean by that is that the settings are pretty much going to stay the same but you'll have recommendations and these are because of um, sustainable power. So what Microsoft will try to do is make you realize that certain settings within your computer might actually be bad for the planet because it increases the power consumption and indirectly probably increases greenhouse gases and stuff like that. So Windows will become and have some settings that will actually kind of hint to you, well, you should use this mode because you know, your PC will use less power and that's kind of better for the planet. So it's uh, implemented in build 557 as a start right now. And um, there possibly will be more options available uh, through this. So if you go into your settings and go into the uh, power settings, you will notice that there's, of course, recommendations at the top. So they're going to say here, for example, sleep is set to never, which uses more power and results in higher carbon emissions. And it will actually ask you if you want to have your device go to sleep. And also the screen is set to never turn off, which uses more power and results in higher carbon emissions. Once again, there's an option that they're suggesting you should use. So these are some of the ways that uh, they're going to try to tell you, um, you know, try to use less power and change these settings is going to help, you know, um, use less power. And, you know, if it's not for carbon emissions, one of the good ideas behind this also is if the cost of electricity is really high where you are, well, you can follow these steps because it means that your computer will actually use less electricity when you use it, thus making your power bill go down. So these are also good recommendations for that. And of course, you have a little something here that you can click, which is power consumption, carbon emissions, brings you to the website of Microsoft, which uh, basically doesn't show anything right now. So it's kind of the page is probably not done yet, but it will eventually probably pop up a page that will actually talk about that. So this is brand new as you see here. So the page isn't even made up yet, which is kind of embarrassing if you, if, if you want my opinion on it. Microsoft should have done the page, especially that now this is here. So new power consumption information and, and suggestions to help you save energy and also um, at the same time kind of uh, lower carbon emissions. So this will come to a Windows computer, of course, in Windows 11 eventually. So these, once again, are future features that are not yet implemented within Windows 11, but for standard users, uh, but will in the next months or at the latest with the big update this fall be implemented within Windows 11. So it's kind of showing you an advanced look at some of the things that are coming to Windows 11. Hope that you enjoy these uh, sneak peek and previews. And of course, if you're on the dev channel, build 22557, you already have all of that that you can go through. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.